So I want to talk to you for a second about what are the management elements of this modern operating model. Um, and the best way is just a two by two. So imagine that we scale the organization's awareness level from low to high on the axis, and then your ability to respond in the moment across the bottom. I'm gonna call level one just unaware, that your information systems and management are not aware of either internal operational issues or external. The next step is delayed. So you know what's going on, but your ability to respond is delayed. It's long after the event has occurred. Obviously, the next step is something along the lines of being aware. You've detected the problem, but you still can't respond effectively in the moment. Then adaptive. You know, we're now aware and able to respond after a short delay. And then finally, we want to get to that level of being predictive, where you're able to predict likely scenarios and take action to mitigate and reduce the risk. So that's what the structure looks like. What do I need in the modern operating model to get there? Well, so at the unaware level, what we see in our, our prospective and target organizations that we talk to is they've got traditional financial measures, which of course are lagging um, not only the event, but our response to it. When you look at organizations that are in this sort of delayed phase, they've got better measures like financial and non-financial, but many of the measures are slightly lagging and they don't have ongoing management meetings. They're periodic as events occur, maybe they're not frequent enough. And they've got processes which are locked in standard operating procedures that people can't change. Organizations that are generally in this category of being aware have a better mix of leading measures. They're still encumbered by hierarchical decision-making. In other words, information has to flow up to senior leadership who makes decisions on behalf of the organization. And the management meetings here still seem to not match the cadence of the business uh, environment they're in. Adaptive, what we begin seeing is way more comprehensive and strategic aligned performance measures, obviously many more leading measures. More frequent regular scheduled management meetings at the appropriate cadence of that organization and environment. We see more empowered employees, people that can make decisions and don't have to push it up to leadership to make choices for them. And a higher performance culture, people are encouraged to make those decisions. And then processes which are agile that can change more frequently. And predictive is what we're beginning to see more and more of these days, where they've got those same comprehensive strategic-centered metrics, but now they've got AI and ML assists you know, looking at things that the human brain can't detect seven by 24 and looking for abnormalities that we don't think to look for. Again, empowered employees, performance culture, and agile processes. So that's the journey that organizations are on. Hopefully this helps you figure out where you and your organization is on this journey.